ladies and gentlemen, bitch, welcome back to the channel, recording live from the mothership. This is episode four of what remains of Edith Finch. Last time we got down, how many, uh, let's see if we could pull it up and check. We got down about four. Last episode, we seen the death of Calvin. No, we didn't see Calvin. We saw Sam, Walter, Gregory, and Gus. We got, uh... We got, we got, a, we got a relative. We got four, we got five more. We got five more. We can get five more. I don't know how much exactly longer, so I'm not gonna go ahead and say this is the final episode because it might not be. We do not know. Can I climb this? I know. Hold on, hold on, hold on now, hold on now. Is there anything else I need to see right now? At the time, it was as far away as she could get. I don't think there is. Let's go ahead and proceed. How's everybody doing, man? I hope you guys are all good. Still don't know really what to think about this story that's going on right now. Uh, people are dying. People are dying. Uh, in some cases, it might be their fault, you know. In in some cases, it, it is just down to bad parenting, like like little baby Gus. She spent a summer building houses in Calcutta, where she met my dad, Sanjay. Okay, so we're getting real close to home right now. My mom real... went to India a week after graduation and got a job teaching English. Good for her. Religion was another thing my mom never talked about, but I think it helped her a lot after her dad died. So she's a Christian. Okay. Lewis was born a year later. Married out of religion, you love to see it. Yo, can you climb up? Thank you, bitch. I gotta remember that it ain't my place to open my mouth during these videos because Edie loves. Dad died, see? Don't think mom knew where else to go. Edith loves. I'm sure Edie was happy to have her back. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. She loves to talk. The house on. had to get a little bigger, but Edie was used to that. She loves to talk over me. Got me out here For rushing. While, things were good. Almost normal. But it didn't last. Can I look around, man? Damn. So she were they they were homeschooled. I guess they didn't wanna They didn't wanna take that curse outside the house. Maybe they took this shit serious. They took this shit serious. Milton's 10th birthday when Edie gave him a castle. Are right, we about to find out what happened to little baby Milton? After Milton disappeared, the only thing he left behind was a room full of paintings. Okay. So Milton was an artist. I say artist because it takes... Not everybody can be an artist, you know? An artist is the highest level. Like, imagine there are levels... To, to be an artist, you know? Artiste is the highest. Level one is just, you know, you can't even call yourself an artist. You, do, you just do art. Oh so, yeah, oh, so you do art? Yeah, that's how, that's how you refer to somebody who's level one. You don't even call them an artist. You just, oh, you do art? Cool. When you get to that top level, artiste. I'm just, where's this going? Where is this going? It can't, it can't, it's Edith's gonna die, right? Edith's gonna die. It's, what's interesting to me is that they ain't made no real, uh, they, they, they've not made any references or any, like, they paid no attention to the fact that she's pregnant, like. I don't know what that means for the story, for Edith herself. Milton Finch in The Magic Peak. Hey, this is clean. A flip book within a flip book? Hey, Milton is something different. This man's an artiste, bro. <laughs> a flip book within a flip book, a door within a flip book. 
Hey, that was clean. Okay, the magic paintbrush. I kind of want to see that again. Let me see that again. Let me see that again. Oh, okay, we can't. That's it? That's it for Milton? Damn, That's Milton cool. died age 10, and he was an artiste? That's crazy. Milton reached that level of artistism <laughs> at 10? Oh, 11. 1992. I thought that was 1993. I thought I said 1993. There's got to be something else in here, bro. Let me read that, that, that book again. We can't get that flip book again. Yo, if anybody ever wants to, you know, give me anything, for whatever reason, a flip Mom's book would be great. Searching for my brother. Then she sealed the doors. Flip books are clean all the time. And all the time, flip books are clean. Whatever Milton had found in the house, Mom didn't want it getting out. Okay. Scoot, scoot forward a little bit. I didn't even see these. Did I come from? I didn't come from these stairs. Cool. Mom definitely blamed Edie, but I think Lewis blamed himself. After he graduated, he just spent more and more time in his room until Mom got him a job at the cannery. Okay, so they do go outside. Which I, I I should have known that it's not like they're all stuck inside. Maybe as children, I don't Everyone know. Everyone always told me to stay. Or maybe they're just homeschool. Maybe there's nothing behind it. Except Lewis. I mean, sometimes kids are just homeschooled. Maybe they, they ain't got ain't gotta be no sinister reason. Still a little bit like this little girl in episode one then turned into a fucking monster. Is there anything behind that? Are we just gonna ignore that? Smelled very, you know, very familiar. That part of him lived on. I find it weird that they've kept like this house is just full of like even people who died centuries ago. You know, like maybe that's why you cursed. Move on! Dear Mrs. Finch, as Lewis's psychiatrist, I can understand your desire for an explanation. As I see it, the trouble began in January, shortly after we convinced your son to seek treatment for substance abuse. Ooh. Newly sober, I believe Lewis first noticed the monotony of his daily life. Yo, bro! He kept working at the cannery. But he withdrew part of himself. In our sessions, I saw the same behavior. His so, mind began to. What did it begin to do? Bitch, tell me. Fade? It began to fade? I can't grab that. Wonder. Oh, what the hell is this? I asked oh him to describe God. it. He said he started small. Imagining a labyrinth. He'd feel his way about. Then something moved. Bats. And toads. It's Batman. He's here to save you! <laughs> What is going things on? Things that have not names. He knew it was all in his head. Uh, this he is took all... it very seriously. Connected! It's connected! But he found something more. Hey, this is kind of... This is kind of lit! Daydreaming at the cannery. I spoke with his boss. But he said Lewis had become a model employee. Can you chop his hand off Methodical, or tireless, focused. 
like a whole new Lewis. So I let him go on. Into the darkness. I even encouraged him. It seemed very promising at first. Well, what happens if I stop chopping the fish's heads off, bro? What happens if I stop fucking with the fish? He told me he'd made a new friend. On the edge of a city he named Lewis Topia. built the city up slowly, brick by brick. Uh, is this man gonna follow me? Follow me! Uh, everybody follow me! I am your king! Uh, Lewis Topia in full effect! And songs for them to play. I can't lie, this game is very different to what I expected. It is kind of lit. I mean, it's nothing special. He's always humming or something. But it is and nice. His imagination grew stronger. Like I said, all of these stories are different, and I like it. He no longer spoke at the cannery. But his chopping was as reliable as ever. Then one day it struck him. That all the cheering crowds, even the stones under his feet, were all in his imagination. So he could do whatever he wished. I am king. He held an election for mayor. And won, of course. And he won. They begged him to stay, but his mind was already wandering. Because I live in Louisville. <laughs> Yo, this man's on a boat, Conquer bro. A city, then no TP. New Louisville. <laughs> I knew it. New Louisville. Saint Louis. Oh uh, man, this man's fucking imagination is drifting on away top from our of this game. How did he die though? How does this story come to an end? Until one day he forgot to go home. Minneapolis! <laughs> Even as his mother pleaded with him, part of Lewis kept sailing on. Give me the fish, bitch! Get your hands out of my face! I have no home! <laughs> I only conquer cities! Minneapolis, that's lit. He heard rumors of a Handsome queen. We love handsome bitches. <laughs> I'm here for the handsome bitches. Yo, my eyes, bro. This can't be good for people who are fucking the epileptic. queen was on her own quest for... Radiant Radiant Radiant. Sinister serpents, huh? Uh, not in Minneapolis. I'm knocking over all the rainbows! We don't want to do that. He followed the sound of her. Oh, it's the heart. Of course it's the heart. Of course it's the heart! Silver heart. Let me hear that tune, bro. Play me a tune, bro. Hey, these stories are, are so well crafted, bro. I have to give them credit. His chase led him to a golden palace east of the sun and west of the moon. Even then, his logic remained sound. He knew the world was all in his imagination. Oh my god, I can't, I can't handle this much fish! My queen! Come back here, bitch! But he was so proud of having hey, created it. I think I can't get in, you know what? I, I run this place! Eyes, he'd become something greater than a king. What did I become? 
<laughs> and Lewis Menace. <laughs> someone who'd never known success in the real world, I think it was overwhelming. And then it struck me that the real Lewis was not the one chopping salmon, but the one climbing the steps of a golden palace. That's true. That's true, I believe. I believe. Lewis is the greatest man in this family. My Only imagination is as real as my body, he told me. Facts. Okay. It was hard to argue with him. Let me in, bro. No one can hold me. I began to forget the world we know. Because it ain't the world he knows, bro. This is the world he knows. I think it pained him to remember Lewis, the cannery worker. I would love for my imagination to be this vivid. He began to despise the man with a royal contempt. You, you little bitch. You ain't shit. You never reach your full potential. Look at me, I'm a king. You are just my subject. You ain't even doing the job right, man. Where's my throne? How did I end up? I done all of this and ended up at a cannery? Don't make sense. Where's my queen? Where is she? Where is she? You ain't doing the job right, man. I still thought I could save him. But you failed. You failed Even as a psychiatrist. He was being crowned king over all the lands of wonder. Goodbye, peasant. <laughs> the palace would be packed yes! with his companions. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes! Ah! <laughs> hey! Good to see you, man! Good to see you! All he my people! Calico and insisted on inviting him. Uh-huh. It was all my people from the, uh, what was it, Lutopia? I bring my people with me, bro. See what I'm saying? Take my seat next to my beautiful handsome queen. Gods. She waited, holding his crown. As a queen should. There was only one thing left to do. Your son was a kind man who will be missed by all of us who knew him. My brother was really cool. I wish you could have met him. Ain't that some bullshit, bro? What the fuck just happened? <laughs> what just happened, bro? Yo. I was I was enjoying that so much. I can't believe they did this to me. Who the fuck? See, I need answers, man. It don't make no sense, man. 
What? So how did he really die? Cause I know that that wasn't his death. What the hell? What in the world, brother? Yo, I'm gonna wrap it up right here, bro. I'm gonna wrap it up. We got two more. We got Dawn and Calvin. Oh, and we got Edie as well. You know what? Should I do another one? Should I do another one? Because we got three left. We might even have Sven and Kay. I don't know. Let's do another one. I thought we had two left. We got three left. So let's get one more in. And then that way... The final video the won't back, have to be too long. Funeral. My mom told me to start packing. She waited until the day before we left to tell Edie. Okay. I'm not sure if she wanted to make it easier or harder. I wish we'd stayed. But I understand why we left. Going on over here. So who, who's, whose room are we in now? This is a big ass fucking. My mom ended up leaving everything behind. I would, I, I, I say house, but, but just a big ass plot of land, I guess. What happened that night had been coming for a long time. Is that Maybe so? We should have come sooner. You seem to know a lot about this story, if I don't know. Talking like you've been here from but the beginning. It had to end one way or another. All that's left now is to tell you about that last night. I mean, you need to tell me about Dawn and, and Calvin and, you know. Oh, we're going to sleep. You, you still sleeping? Where you where? Hold on, what are you doing, bit? What, Edith? You're gonna write your own story? I don't know if that's a good the idea. Last you gonna day. Die. Edie just watched his pack and didn't say a word. Until supper, when she raised her glass and said, To our final night together. And Better. all our final nights apart. Grandma, you know what I said about alcohol. Some of your medications are very Edith, specific. I left a present for you in the hallway. Why don't you go open it? The grown-ups have to argue now. I'm sorry, you're right. We're all leaving tomorrow. Let's just enjoy our last... I'm not leaving. Edith, you're excused. Oh, about to have a super showdown in the living room. Dining room, sorry. The power had been shut off that morning, but Edie always had plenty of candles. Mm -hmm. When my mom sailed the library, I don't think she knew about the other entrance. Or that Edie had a key to it. Oh, Edie's a fucking... Sly little girl, bro. So where is Edie? The thing you're afraid of isn't going to end when you leave the house. Edith has a right to know these stories. My children are dead because of your story. I think it's best if Edith and I leave tonight. We'll have the nursing home send a van for you in the morning. Okay. Ooh. You're sending her to a home? Dear Edith, there's so many stories I wish I could tell you. But there's only time for one. This is about what happened on the night you were born. Is Edie the grandma? Night, the tide went way, way out. Oh, okay, I'm in control. I thought you were just gonna tell me a story, but you want me to it tell the story. It was the first and last time I ever saw the old house aground. There'd been an earthquake out in the middle of the ocean. They called it the lowest tide in a thousand years. God, it smelled awful. No, I've seen that house every day of my life. Never thought I'd go back to it. Okay. When the fog rolled in, I lost my way. 
I'm gonna guess that the grandma is eating. I got turned around. Which is kind of throwing me off. I, I didn't think that was the case. Where the hell am I, bro? I can only hope I'm going the right I way. Started seeing things. There we go. I mean, there might have been a day there. You might not have been seeing things. Things I'd forgotten had ever existed. A deer? You forgot a deer existed? Okay. But when I saw them, they felt like old friends. That night, a lot of things came back to me. Or maybe I came back to them. Honey, I am fucking home. Crank this gate open for your boy. Things I can't explain, but that I need you to try and... Edith, what are you doing in here? It's mine. Edith! Mom, you're gonna rip it! Let go! I, I, wanna, I, I wanna... kicked and screamed, but... Mom dragged me to the car. No, I, I wanna know! I wanna know how it ends! I never saw a great grandma Edie again. Mommy! Mommy! Where is my mommy? Why is the car so Next dark? Morning, the van came to pick her up. She was already gone. Who is driving this vehicle? After that, we moved around a lot. I worry as hell, bro. We both tried to make the best of it. A few years went by. This is a very artistically creative game. My mom didn't like to talk about it. But she started getting sick a lot. <coughs> Bitch, you just... The rest okay, never mind. Quickly. You just coughed all over my shit. <laughs> oh no. Mommy. She got better for a while. And then she didn't. And then I was alone. The last finch left alive. It's crazy. That is a flex though, I can't lie. <laughs> Until I found out about you. That is a flex. Me? I'm still not sure what to tell you about all this. If we lived forever, Maybe we'd have time to understand no, things. No, 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 no. Stop with a we. Stop with a we. You. But as it is, you. I think the best we can do is try to open our eyes. Your eyes. I am not involved. I appreciate in this. how strange and brief all of this is. You ain't even trying to let me talk in the early parts of the war for now. You trying to drag me into this? You. No. You. No, the channel was for you. But now I hope you'll never see it. I just want to meet you <laughs> and tell you all these stories myself. I don't. I'm not. I don't. I, I, guess I, I don't agree. This now. Things didn't work out that uh, way. Oh, she took it to the baby. The baby's making his way. Oh, Edith is dead and gone. No, but she can't be because she's giving birth. This is where your story begins. I'm sorry, I won't be there to see it. It's a lot to ask. But I don't want you to be sad that I'm gone. I want you to be amazed that any of us ever had a chance to be here at all. Good luck. Uh, Edith Finch is gone, bro. But what remains of Edith is this pure little boy. Okay. That doesn't clear up the curse for me, but you know. Mm, I still have questions. Why did that little girl turn into a cat, then a bird, then a shark, then a monster? That's all? That's the game? 
I ain't gonna lie. This this what I did. This was clean in many ways. I really like, like I said, I really like the fact that all of these stories were very different. They all had a different art style, a different like they all like that last one with Lewis. That was clean, bro. It was like a mini game of itself. Like a nice. I like it. The comic book one. She was. It was. It was nice. You know, they were all very. Again, are very artistically uh, creative in the in the style and approach. Even the one with the photography and the, the Sam got beasted by the deer. I like it. I like it. Uh, you know, I got to be a a, a, a cat and a, and a bird. It's all very different and creative. Very, stuff that you don't usually see in a lot of video games. So I like that. Uh, as for the story, though, I don't really see. I don't really see where it went. They just filled in Dawn. Who's Dawn? Oh, I guess Dawn is the one from Sanjay. I don't know, but there's nothing for Calvin. Why is Calvin this? Interesting. But yeah, like I'm saying, uh... It... It, it didn't really tie anything together it don't really seem like it had like in each individual story was cool in its own like uh in its own condensed world almost but i just don't see how they all connect to a bigger story to a bigger ending to a bigger plot you know there's a curse okay where do we go with this curse what where, where does it I don't, I don't it, it's a, the ending is a bit unsatisfying I can't lie to you bro uh, we didn't really learn anything about anyone like Molly why did she turn into a cat and and then it turned into a monster and how did she how was she killed by a monster who are these things that killed Barbara uh, 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 why was my head chopped off as Lewis you know uh, many questions to be answered it, it, obviously that's not how they really died I guess I'm assuming so how did they really die did they just die and disappear is there really a curse if that's the case if they just died of natural causes I mean uh, I don't know bro I, I feel like I feel like this game this is the type of game where it's all building up Oh, you're, you're laying seeds and plant, you're planting seeds and, you know, weaving some threads that build up to a bigger story that you all t put together to make this big revolution. And that revolution never came. And that, it never went anywhere. So, a little bit disappointed. I, I can't lie. Each individual story was cool, like I said. But we just didn't really get anything out of it. Uh, I hope you guys did enjoy this walkthrough. I hope you guys... Uh, Got some some uh, some enjoyment out of these stories. I hope maybe you maybe you learn maybe you see the bigger picture that I missed. If you did, then go ahead and let me know in the comment section. But for now, I will wrap this up. I will be starting another walkthrough in the place of what remains of Edith Finch. I don't know what it's going to be as of yet. Uh, so I mean, it might take a few days while I decide. If you have any suggestions, go ahead and put it in the comment section down below. Maybe I'll put a poll on the channel page. Uh, I'll probably do that. I'll probably put a poll on the channel page. And until next time, peace.